Mina, Claude Bonnois, Jesus Freaking Gamer here. Apparently there's another NPC in the area. That's all I can say, apparently. God damn it and fuck. Some bullshit. Okay. Got it. Then he just, he popped out of nowhere. I'm in the middle of grinding out this area. And he just popped out of goddamn fucking nowhere. Hey, look at my souls. 140,940. Yes. I've been grinding away this area. Mainly primarily to get rid of enemies. But he popped that was the third time he popped up. At first I honestly thought he was some fucking um just uh like blah, 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 blah. actual person like PvP. Nah that's an NPC. He kept appearing. I don't know what the trigger points for these NPCs are. I I wish I knew. I wish I knew how exactly that worked. But I don't is there, have I gotten anything else? Uh, oh, the Elan Captain Armor. I'm taking notes. Like, if I get something new, I'm like, okay, I'm going to take a note so I can tell the people about this. The Captain Armor. Armor worn by the Captain of the Elan Knights. Several captains in the area. Whenever you see the electric -y sword, that's a captain. The accoutrements of the Elan Knights who serve the Old Iron King were created with an advanced casting technique. They remain solid and handsomely crafted. The design is styled after the armor worn by an unusual knight who trained the Iron King's men in the sword. He was said to have deserted his liege after bearing witness to his descent into depravity. Yeah, the Iron King's now some fucking bull. Some lava minotaur of some kind. Apparently, yeah, in this world, humans can become monsters depending on what the fuck they're doing. And the black steel katana, the katana that they use, yeah, High dex scales well with dex, and it bleeds on me when they use it. There's no bleed, um, there's no bleed if I use it. That's a little unfair, and good fucking gosh. Very low starting stats, but damn if it doesn't work well for them. Black Steel Katana wielded by Alon Knights. One of the sturdiest types of katana, preferred by masters of the quick draw. Quick is definitely the appropriate word for the Alon Knights. In the heyday of his land, the old Iron King fancied entertaining dubious and eccentric guests from faraway lands. Most of them were charlatans, but among the riffraff was an unusual knight from the far east. He trained the Iron King's men in the sword in obeisance to his new lord. So there's the shit on that. And did I just... I was like, yeah, I just killed that guy. So... Blah, blah, blah. Time to tackle a knight. So I've actually got the entire... Oh, that one's dead. Finally and completely. Awesome. Time to tackle some more guys then. This is really just a grind, but I was like, you know what? I've got to show these guys the new stuff. And who knows, maybe the grinding will come to an end here. Maybe something will come to an end here. Maybe this will be the time when something cool happens. Run to this guy here. Without going into the lava pit. Okay, good. That worked out well. Anything from him? Nope, not a fucking thing. I was like, someone runs down and jumps at me usually. There we go. So let's pull this shit right here. Make him fall down. <laughs> That's so funny. Grab those souls and move along. Holy fucking hell, what the goddamn fucking shit is that? 
he hit me from all the way over there. Are you serious? Are you fucking serious? Apparently he is. You want to play? Do you want to play? Oh, he wants. Oh, you want to play? Okay. My grinding can include you this time around. More than happy to oblige. Alrighty. I guess I'll oblige you too. God damn it, man. Fuck. Come here, piece of shit. Fucking cunt. Okay. Let's see into that guy. I have not been farming this room. Farming out here. Well, I farmed the first few guys in the room. Just the first few. That way, whenever I do come back, the first few pieces of shit are gone and done and it's over with. A little bit easier the next time through. Not to mention, shit, look at the souls. I'm gonna level up nice and good. So I wanna level up vitality, although I'm tempted to level up vigor and stamina, or I should say endurance, a little bit. Because the enemies here are striking so hard. Oh, that was the wrong way. That was not the right way. And it just seems right now that I could use a little bit of those things. Those things seem like they would do me a lot of good. Come on down, fellas. Come on down. I want to say hi to you. I didn't set an alarm for this because I just started the thing so suddenly it makes sense that I wouldn't. Nice, even better. Oh, he's alive. I'll come to you. I'll come to you. I'll make it easy on you. There we go. There we are. And then back through here. Works for me. I guess I was recording for what? 10-ish minutes? A minute ago? Something like that? Yeah, something like that. Yeah, nothing else for you. The guy behind me, he can hit me one time. You're not allowed to do shit. Okay. He didn't draw fast enough. He is not allowed to hit me another time. Have the entire lawn set in the lawn captain armor. If I get the lawn captain helm, I'd be in good shape. I'd be finished. And the lawn set, like I said earlier, that was one of the sets that I was considering for end game, but it just it, it didn't happen. So I was like, okay, ne never mind. <laughs> Apparently, that is not something I'm going to be using in game. At least not the lawn captain knight helm. But no, I've decided on another set entirely that will not be the finale. Already have my decisions elsewhere. So I guess this will be a grinding video. It just has something a little bit new at the beginning of it. And I'm glad I, since I really thought it was an NPC, so I didn't care about the first two times that I died. I'm really and truly glad that that did not. I'm glad it happened a third time. That way I was able to capture it on camera. That worked out extremely well. So, continuing on. Everything in there is already dead. Permanently. Haha. Uh -huh. And everything over there, yep, all of those guys, they're permanently dead. They're not coming out anymore. Time to get rid of these guys here. Let's do this. Oh, I'm gonna level up so nicely. It's gonna be great. 
quite a few things will be gone. And hit you right between the eyes. No, you're not tearing that down. You may tear me down. You're not tearing that down. Come here. And no. No quick strike for you. Sassy McSue. Coming down. Speaking of coming down. Give me the souls. Yes. Let's see you hit me with your stupid arrows from here. That ain't gonna work for you, is it? Didn't think so. That way, every other time I come through here, it'll be ten fuckloads easier. Ten, very specifically. Okay, that guy's dead. Actually, I should say those guys, I think there were like two knights there. Well, not anymore! Oh. One of them's dead permanently. I'll take that. I'll sure as heck take that. 187 definitely need more arrows. Those are easy to get. Let's kill you off. No item dropped. Very good. Drink an Estus. Let's kill you off. Helmet! Oh, no. That wasn't it. You know, always under the Covenant of Champions and uh, grind away at him that way, but I'm not exactly in the mood for that. Don't exactly desire for that to happen. But again, I don't plan on using that set for the finale anyway, so eh. Not overly important. Not really that much of an appeal anymore. Emptying out this area, making it easier to traverse. Now that holds much appeal to me. I wonder not how. I wonder how non-traditional my approach to this is. Do other guys who are aware, who are aware that you can get rid of enemies permanently, do they also like just go through this over and over and over again until like eventually, okay, area is basically cleared out, or is it just like people like me who completely suck? And they're just like, okay, until the enemy's dead, I won't be able to get through this area. Then they get through the area so many times, they're like, oh, the enemy's not reappearing. What the heck's going on? Oh, I guess they permanently die after enough times. I just I wonder how many people experience that. Okay, he's permadead. Slowly but surely getting there. I'm slowly but surely making it. You know what, I'm going to go ahead and call this episode a wrap. It's close to 20 minutes, or at least I think it's close to 20 minutes. And I'm just going to be grinding a little bit more. So thank you guys very much for watching this video. If you liked it, hit that like button. If you disliked it, hit that dislike button. And if you really liked it, be sure to share with a friend, subscribe, and join the freaks! I love you, and God bless.